amigos! Thanks for joining us for STEM time. Today we are going to make a paper horse that walks all on its own. Let's get to it! Alright, for your paper horse, you're only going to need a few things. You're going to need a pencil, some scissors, a ruler, and a piece of cardstock. But if you don't have cardstock at home, you can always use one of those mailers you get in the mail. It's pretty sturdy instead of just a piece of paper because it, it works better with, with a sturdier paper. And so what we're gonna do is, we're gonna give you the measurements. I'm just gonna show them to you really quickly. And we're gonna use centimeters. So we're gonna use the edge of the paper and we're gonna measure 15 centimeters across and four and a half centimeters wide. Four and a half over here. And then connect your dots. And then we're gonna make marks at the five centimeters, every five centimeters. So at the five and the 10. And then I'll do it down here. The five, the 10, and then we'll connect those dots. So the middle square is gonna be our body and then we need to make the, the legs and the head and the tail. So over here on that four and a half wide side, you're gonna make marks every one and a half centimeters. So one and a half, three, and then, oh, let's do it right here. One and a half, And then we're gonna connect those dots. Like this. Okay, so I didn't make lines in the middle because that's gonna be the body. These lines that I just made on the side these lines right here, that's what we're gonna cut with our scissors. So I'm gonna cut out the whole entire thing. And then we're just gonna cut, cut up this line and we're gonna stop right there. Then we'll do the other side. Okay, so we've got, these are gonna be our legs. This is gonna be the head. So we can fold that back and we can fold this one back. If you wanna be really precise with your, your measurements, you can fold along, or your bent, your fold, I should say, you can fold along the ruler. So we've got that bend there, and then we can fold along the ruler right there. Okay, so you can kind of see, there's the, the body taking shape. And then it, we wanna um, make sure that our head and our tail are balanced. So I'm gonna get my pencil, and it's kind of like when you curl ribbons, you're just gonna do that and your, your tail will curl up. There you go. And then for the head, I like to uh, fold it kind of halfway. So you fold it halfway, and then you're gonna curl this up, 
kind of like that. And then you just kind of stick it out. And there's your, there's your head. Okay, so the last step is you have to get a little bit, you have to cut a little bit off of each leg. So I'm gonna draw, just it's a little slant. You want a little curve along the edges of the horse's feet. I don't know if you can see that, but it's just a tiny little curve. And I'm gonna cut it so you can see. You're gonna curve it out. tiny little arch if you can see it's kind of curved a little bit curved okay on each end and then you're gonna do the same thing for the front legs curve it out draw little lines go ahead and do that and then we're just gonna cut that little bit off And now your horsey is ready to race. The only thing is just when you're folding the legs in, make sure they are balanced. The front legs are balanced together and the back legs are balanced together. And there you go, this horsey's ready to race. All right, the horsies need to be at an angle in order for them to race. So I got the top of a box and I put the, a stack of books, I put it on top of a stack of books You'll want to play with the angle, how high or how low it needs to be for the horses to race. And then you'll also want to play with the materials you put them on. This is a piece of foam paper. They like this kind. I tried a piece of paper and they just slid right on off. So you might try some material at home if you don't have foam paper. And now we're going to race. Which ones? Place your bets. The yellow or the orange. Here we go. Three, two, one. And they're all. 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 And you could even make several horses and place your bets on which would go the fastest. Please comment below on what happened during your experiments. Thanks for joining us. Bye.